Greetings and salutations. Uh, big news. Uh, this is uh, in memory of those uh, people who may have suffered from the latest uh, bout of weather that came through uh, the Tennessee area, the Chattanooga, Tennessee area, up through Cleveland, uh, Fort O, you know, down in the northern Georgia. Uh, I, I know there's a couple of people saying it wasn't a tornado, but it, it looks really, really like a tornado. And I'm looking at the news. Of course, today is, what is today, Monday? Monday yeah, I think it's Monday. Um, of course, this isn't out on Monday. but uh, So, with that in mind, with the uh, really nasty stormy weather in mind, we lost uh, uh, power uh, last night. I guess it was uh, about 11.30. Right about the same time we got a tornado warning. And uh, we all huddled up in our little area in the, in the hallway. And eventually power came back on in about 10 to 15 minutes and everything passed and it was fine. Uh, so most of the East Ridge was spared. Uh, but other areas, East Brainerd, that kind of thing, uh, Uluwal, Port Over Fort, uh, a couple areas down there I think were hit, uh, uh, was, not, was not a real good thing. But with that in mind, tonight's drink is based on what is called a dark and stormy. Normally a dark and stormy, depending on uh, who you talk to and what bar you get it, that kind of thing, they use a particular kind of rum and a ginger beer. And some places will even use a particular kind of ginger beer. Now I don't do ginger beer because it's just extra, it's just a strong, you know, ginger flavored soda, really. I mean, it's it's not really like real beer or anything. It's just a really strongly flavored mixer. Uh, so what I do instead is I use ginger ale, uh, Domaine de Canton, uh, Canton, whatever it is. It's a ginger flavored liqueur. It's a ginger liqueur. And my personal favorite uh, spice rum, uh, Kraken, because it's nice and dark. It's got a nice flavor to it. I think I've got some other other rums down there, some dark rums. Um, you want to use a nice dark rum, a nice spice rum. Don't use like this regular Bacardi's, that kind of thing, because you're not going to get the same effects. It's not going to get the same flavor. And mostly all you're going to get is ginger. All right? All right. So, we're going to take a shot of the ginger liqueur. Any yeah, ice. Then, we're going to put the ginger ale on it. Like this. Okay. And then we want to pop the top on the crack in here. See? That is a dark and stormy. This is like the unofficial drink of, I think it's the Bahamas. I think it's the Bahamas. And it's reflective of, you know, dark clouds in the skies. And uh, there's a story about a sailor who lost his ship and all that kind of stuff. But I like it. It's a great flavor. The ginger mixes with the spiced rum really well. If you get one flavor more than the other, or if you want to, to mix a little bit, go ahead and stir it up. But this is not a dark and stormy. Thanks to good friends Rick and V, they introduced this to me. They call this the rough and stormy. So, <clears throat> it's good stuff. All right, hope you weathered the storms. Remember to wash your hands, stay inside, and if you like what you see, hit that like button, set, uh, subscribe, and share with all your friends. Thanks. Have a great one.